This is Sarah Poff and those art hands. We're going to sculpt some caterpillars today. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do, I have a little pattern for our leaf. I'm going to take this, trace around. Okay, then I'm going to cut it out. Okay, so now what I want to do is I want to put the veins in the leaves so I have a different color of green than my paper. I'm using woodless because I like how they show up. The contrast is nice with them. some dimension. Okay, and then I'm just going to rub lightly because I don't want a lot, but I know that that leaf wouldn't be all the same color. I do like that. Okay, then I'm going to take my cardboard on it. I'm going to put it down the middle of my leaf. This gives some stability to the caterpillar so when you're carrying him out and it may slide like that. It's going to take it just a little bit to dry. And I'm going to push it down I need to actually, I'm going to take it off a little bit and push it down as far as I can. I don't want it to show. I don't want the cardboard to show here. But I want to put this stem right there. And we'll leave these on the tray to dry. And that, and that way, hopefully, they'll stay together. Once they've dried, it's going to be a little hard till they didn't. Till they do. I'm going to put my name right here. Okay, so now I have my leaf ready. Then you're going to get a piece of Model Magic. Something kind of like this. And I think we ought to try to do seven. One, two, so I'm doing a little pinch of three, four, five, six, seven okay and then I'm going to pinch off a teeny little bit it's going to be for his antennas all right now I'm going to kind of look at those try and see if I can make them even as even as I can then I'm going to roll each one trying to make it into a nice ball so I'm rolling it between my fingers rolling it between my fingers Roll, 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 roll your boat. Nope. Roll, 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 roll your clay. Make a nice ball. Roll, 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 roll. Roll till it looks nice. Sometimes I just start singing. Making up crazy little songs. Roll, 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 roll your clay. Until it becomes a ball. Make it nice, make it nice. Roll it nice and smooth. All right, we're almost there, almost there. Okay, now we got it. Okay, so now what I wanna do is I'm gonna kinda make an S kind of shape because I want my caterpillar to have a little character. I want him to be a little curvy. I want him to be so straight. And I'm gonna put my balls together. That'd be his sections. Okay, 
Okay. Then I'm going to look at him. Oh, but I did this upside down, actually. I want the brown side to show because I want it to look like a stem. I'm glad I caught that. Sometimes I make mistakes, too. I gotta just keep trying. Just keep trying. Keep working at it. Trying to get it right. It's not fun when you make a mistake, but you just keep going until you get it right. I think I want my head right there. So here's what I'm going to do. Take a skinny little marker like this. Going to mash that in. Make it look like an eye. See how I mashed it in pretty far? And I'm going to just draw a little smile. Yep, one little spot for his nose. All right, now. Oh, I meant to put a toothpick in my little bag for his antennas. I, however, did not. So I'm going to show you with this one. See, I took right there and I stuck a toothpick, a part of a toothpick, a part of a toothpick. I put a little glue like this, like this, like this, and like that. Yeah. Sometimes it's hard. Okay, there we go. Or you can make it like this without. I almost think it looks cuter without. So that's my caterpillar. You have a great day now. This is Sarah Pop and those art hands.